Alright guys, so I'm coming at you from Manila, Philippines. Today is our first day in the beautiful country of the Philippines. And we are in Manila. We're gonna go to Manila and then a bunch of other places. But guys, check out the traffic. So this is the hotel I'm staying at. But yeah, guys, so we're gonna walk around a little bit. We will see what's going on. But yeah, the traffic and the smog is bad today, guys. Really bad. Baby girl, won't you come my way? Hop up in that plane, maybe we could spend a day. Somewhere in the world where it's you and just me. Where it's you and just me. And shawty, won't you come my way? Got a lot of things that I'm wanting to say. Listen, baby girl, won't you come my way? Alright guys, so, I was getting ready over there, down to walk to the Mall of Asia. And then I realized that right across the street was Jollibee. Guys, Jollibee is like the most famous restaurant chain in the Philippines for chicken. They actually, a friend of mine opened one up in San Antonio, Texas, which actually has a pretty decent sized Filipino community. So let's go check out Jollibee, guys. All right, guys, so after a delicious breakfast, or it's my breakfast, but it's actually a dinner at Jollibee, we're gonna head to the biggest mall in Asia. They call it the Mall of Asia here in Manila. How you doing? So we're in Pasay City, which is Metro Manila. And this area is nice, guys. Like, we got the Double Dragon Plaza. It's really got cool stuff. It was just raining and the rain stopped, so I'm out walking. Good thing when I was in Singapore last night, I was able to pick up some new mounts for the GoPro. So hopefully, we get some better footage, some more stable footage. I even got a, a, a new mount for the table so I can, you know, mount my phone, mount basically an all-in-one mount, which was nice, so. But yeah, if you look all the way down there, it's the Mall of Asia. My buddy was like, yeah, I love I, the hotel you did, the hotel you picked out, I love it because every time I go to the Mall of Asia, that's where I stay. So, let's walk down there. Sorry I look tired guys. I got in at like seven to the hotel, slept till one, and then we're back at it. So, we only have a couple of days in Manila before we head out to another city. So we gotta make the best of it, right? So far, Everyone's been so sweet guys. The kids went absolutely bonkers at Jollibee when they saw the camera out. So that was pretty cool They came out and started dancing So it was a lot of fun guys, but uh, Just as in with all the countries in Asia like everyone's so sweet. So I'm hoping I'm hoping we, we keep that going guys. You see me out in public Come up and say hi Tell me about your country. Tell me why you love it so much, so. That is one of my goals of this whole, this whole thing is to get people to travel more. Just, just to let you know guys, just to let you know, uh, one thing you have to take into consideration is we're still coming out of the pandemic, right? So, one interesting fact about the Philippines, they actually still had uh, restrictions up until about um, like a month ago, right? So, you actually have to wear a mask when you enter, when you like get off the plane, you have to wear a mask still. So, that's something to take into consideration. I think out of the 20 countries I've been to this year, this is the only country that's had that requirement. So, I'm guessing that means they had a big problem with COVID at its height. So, 
Um, just something to take into consideration. You have to make sure you're vaccinated or you will have to quarantine. A lot of the hotels here actually were quarantine hotels. Um, they, you, when you come here, if you're a US citizen, you don't need a visa, but you have to do a health declaration. Um, it's like a QR code. If you don't have it, you have to quarantine. So you get off the airplane, you go to, if you go to, the, if you have the QR, you go to the right. If you don't, you have to go to the left. So, and then you'd meet with quarantine officials, but I'm vaccinated and uh, had my QR code, so I was good. All right guys, so today we're out here at the Mall of Asia. Look how big this thing is. They even have a big world thing, statue outside. starting to drizzle again. Hopefully it stops raining. We need to get across the street, but it's all blocked off here. We're, I think we're gonna have to walk around. Oh no, they have an up and over. All right, so what you'll realize is they have these everywhere so that you can get up and over and not cross traffic and get hit. All right guys, so we're back out here at the Mall of Asia. Walk into the main entrance. You have to go through security, which is interesting. is the store that does all the Santa Fe jerseys. Oh, new era. Check out, what do they have? Lakers. What's up, man? What's up? Man, y'all love basketball here, huh? Yes, sir. Yeah. Ooh, kettle corn. No, you're okay. We need to go to the DJI store, see if we can get a pocket, a mini pocket. guys coming at you from the NBA store here in Manila Philippines if you notice here in the Philippines they love basketball attention to detail by Wiggins going under that flare screen how you doing I know this is wild guys look at this Jordan Clarkson. Brown. Way off. And Draymond Green the rebound. Comes up quick plays here to start the board. Thompson. No hesitation. Ties the game. Play Thompson from downtown. And Jalen Brown immediately looks to the ground. Discouraged. Grew up. He made a mistake. Allowed to cool, end guys. <laughs> you guys want to know how tall I am? Not even. Sacramento's 
17 for Brown. Williams to drive. Looking for somebody. And he throws it away. Good defense by Jermon Green with better offense. Jalen Brown, that's a tough shot. And Steph Curry back into the ball game by Tony Green and Steve Curry. Steve Curry, this could be a championship finish. I don't want to go there without the best player. Uh, So right when you walk out the mall, the mall is right over here. Look at this boardwalk area. This is awesome. So they've got kids rides over here. This is freaking cool guys. There's bars, restaurants, a boardwalk. This is neat. Hook and duck. So there's games over here, fruit juice. This is cool. I didn't expect this. I didn't realize we were even that close to the water. Hey, man, let's go. <laughs> How are you? That's my stop. <laughs> That's cool, guys. But yeah, look at that sunset. So there's downtown Manila right there, guys. You can see it in the distance. Look how beautiful that sunset is. So you can walk all the way down. That's downtown right there, city center. Right over here is Mall of Asia. We've got a kids park. Right there is gonna be, I think that's Makati or Passe, but I'm not sure. I think that's Makati City. Like. This place is cool, man. Like, you know, you come to Asia and you just get surprised more and more and more every day, guys. Like, every day, something surprises me. Everything I thought about a lot of the countries I visited was incorrect. Like, so, a lot of mishaps have happened on this trip, but at the same time, it's been a blessing like I've seen so many beautiful things met so many beautiful people this has been an amazing experience guys you gotta come down here we've got Starbucks I've got bars I think we need to go in and have a drink what do you guys think
Look at that sunset. That is freaking gorgeous. Oh.